I want to tell you a story about the dangers of vaping. I had a roommate who loved to vape. And one day he told myself and our other roommate that he was going to enter a vaping competition, but he needed the train before going into it. So he was gonna lock himself into his room and no matter what happened, we were not allowed to let him out. So we went in there and we could hear the Harley sounds coming out of his vape. It's a Harley brand vape pen stick. And it wasn't too long until we could see the vape smoke coming out from underneath the door. And it was filling up to the top of the room. And, and the vape just kept coming and coming. And we looked at each other and looked at the door and he told us we're not allowed to open up the door to go to make sure he's okay. So we just sat there and watched as more vape smoke came out. And maybe after a minute or so, he started pounding on the door and screaming, screaming, let me out, let me out. I need to get out. My roommate, she jumped up and ran to the door and I tripped her and she flew into the kitchen. And she looked at me and said, Mr. Catman, we need to save him. Why won't you let us save him? I said, he told us not to let him out. And I'm going to be a good roommate and we are not going to let him out. And she looked at me. She said, really, Mr. Catman? Not even for this? She started unbuttoning her shirt and she reached in and pulled out a very special thing. A card that entitles anybody who holds it to the special nacho fry menu at Taco Bell. And I said, you're right. And I went over to the door and I said, banging on it and I'm banging on it. Come on, man. Come on, man, I need your, uh, I'm trying to get in. I can't get in. How do I get in? And I looked around for help and I noticed my cat. I said, Sadie, we need to get in this room. Help me. She just looked at me. I said, Sadie, our roommate's dying. He's vaping himself to death. She still looked at me. And I said, Sadie, food is at stake. Sadie jumped up walked right through the door. It crumpled around her like a delicious soft shell taco from Taco Bell. She went into the vape smoke. The vape smoke is filling the whole room. We had to open up the windows to get it out. She went in there and dragged the lifeless, waterlogged body of my now former roommate out of there. He had drowned in his own vape smoke. The only consolation was that I got to go to the Taco Bell and get the secret menu that has the nacho fries on it. And myself and our other roommate, well, I guess now the only roommate, we, we enjoyed those delicious Taco Bell nacho fries. And you know, they don't have a, a taco, nacho fry taco. Like they could make the taco out of nacho fry. They have nacho tacos where the, the taco was made out of nachos, the material that they make out of nacho, so why can't they do it? Why have they Why have they not done this? Why do they keep taking the nacho fries away? Why do they keep bringing them back and then taking them away? It's not fair. And why have they never made a nacho fry taco? And I would never have found out this had my roommate not drowned in his vape smoke. So the next thing you th next time you think about wanting the vape, and, and you know who you are, you know exactly who you are, I want you to think about my roommate that drowned vaping. And the next time you vape, just think, maybe, maybe I'm going to be next. Maybe I'll be the next person to drown vaping. I'm going to die vaping, you might think. And then you're going to think, Mr. Catman, thank you so much. And Mr. Catman, this is going to, this is such a, you're such a great friend to tell me not to vape that 
I'm going to take you up on that offer to go to Maine and just go out to the woods and uh, test out the new Maine uh, amendment about cannibalism. You know who you are. Let's, let's go.